welcome to the Pink Moon Tarot. Today's deck of choice is going to be Wisdom of the Hidden Realms. These are Oracle Cards by Colette Baron reed This is what the front of the box looks like. I know that this is a reprinted version. There are, um, there are older versions probably available on eBay. Um, but this is a beautiful version. It's, it's from Hay House and it's a lovely solid box that's the back of the the box there with the isbn number inside you've got this beautiful purple it comes with its guidebook which again with colette baron reed is a lovely sized guidebook very easy to follow um, each of the cards has its own page and its own description there are um, sections in here about um, how to use the cards. So you've got the purpose of the cards, how to use the cards, how to do a reading, a single card reading and a three card reading. So she gives you, you know, a, a nice comprehensive little guide here. And, um, and that's, you know, that's always helpful. And there's something in the back here about anywhere, anytime card readings. Oh, I don't know if that's to do with this, but anyway. Um, so, yeah, this was published in Australia. It's got a little piece, very little piece about the author at the back here. Okay. The inside of the box, again, just plain, but it, it is a beautiful purple. So this is what the back of the cards looks like. Absolutely stunning. It's quite a glossy card again. Um, you have uh, an extra card in here that tells you about the author or the illustrator rather um, and the contact details for that person. And then we have 44 Oracle cards, which is kind of standard for an Oracle card deck. As you can see, they're quite, um, quite large. They're larger than an average card stock. Um, they are good, thick cards um, and fairly glossy. So we start off with the High Lady of Com Love and Compassion. I'm not going to read you the little bits underneath. If you're interested, you can always zoom in and have a look yourself. The High Lord of Gratitude and Service. Oh, and these are numbered as well. The Spirit Whisperer. I love this card. The Web Weaver. I love this one as well. In fact, I love most of them. The Spiral Dancer. How beautiful is that? The Diamond Dreamer. The Well Watcher. And the rain is absolutely lashing down outside my window. So if you can hear a, a, a noise that sounds like a train, it's actually rain. The dream walker. The ringmaster of scrutiny. The arrow master. I love that. It reminds me of Legolas. The Hawk Prince. The Eagle King. Sorry, the light catches on these because they are glossy, like I say. The Swan Queen. Isn't that gorgeous? The Hungry Ghosts. The Queen of the Light. The Shadow Queen. Well, if you've got the Light Queen, you've got to have the Shadow one as well. Sisters of the Seasons. It's beautiful. Gaia's Garden. Well, Gaia's getting her garden watered at the moment. Blooming heck, that rain. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it, but it's seriously coming down. The Desert Prince. 
The Lady of the Gift. Stunning. The Wise Woman of Wonderland. I love that. Any reference to Alice in Wonderland, I love. The Resting Tree. The Dragon's Duel. Stunning again. The Map Maker of Destiny. The Eyes of Beauty. The Rainbow Prince. Love him. The Sacred Union. The Ice Queen. The Phoenix. I have a painting of a phoenix on my wall. My friend did for me. Love phoenix. The Chess Queen. That's definitely not me. I have no idea how to play chess. The Prison Waif. The Sun Dancers. The Camel Boy. The Winged Wise Ones. I'm just going to read the bit underneath this so that you know that the name on the card does come with an extra bit of explanation, but I just haven't been reading those bits underneath. So this one, the winged wise one says, angelic help, miracle, miraculous aid. The lady of lightning. That's so stunning. The River Queen. I love that as well. The Metal King. The Keeper of the Scales. The Altar Princess. This is the one that's on the front of the box. The Fire Prince. The Cosmos. I love that. The Horse King. The Word Lord. Looks like Dumbledore. <laughs> And the Lady of the Mirror. And that's your 44 cards. And like I say, these are um, slightly larger but, and glossy, but they aren't overly glossy, so they're not overly slippy. They are, there's only 44, so it makes it quite easy to do your, um, your shuffles. You're not holding too many in your hands at once. They shuffle nicely like this. They're not so great at the other shuffle, the big girl shuffle as I call it. Um, but that might just be my technique, I don't know. Oh, I don't know, that was all right, yeah. I don't tend to shuffle these that way. I tend to shuffle these like this. But they shuffle nicely, they're good card stock. Um, it's Hay House, so it's good quality and um, Colette Baron reed really does give you great little handbooks to go with her things. And the boxes are nice and sturdy to keep your cards really in lovely condition. I've had these for quite a while and I've used them quite a lot and they still look brand new. So that's, that's always a good indication of good cardstock. But that's it for now. Um, I, oh, I will link um, in the comment box below um, I have an affiliate link for Amazon if you want to purchase these. Um, they're very easy to work with. 
Um, but as it is an affiliate link, it does mean that if enough people buy it through my link, I will get a percentage of that. Um, but it doesn't affect the cost to you at all. But full disclosure, you can get these in lots of other places as well. They are still in print. Um, I think you can also order them directly from Hay House if you're in um, the States or in the Southern Hemisphere. I think it's Australia that Hay House is based. Um, and uh, you can also get them in, you know, your local bookshops like I think Waterstones do them and... Um, WH Smiths and also the book depository. So there's lots of places you can buy them. But if you do use my affiliate link, just be aware that I may actually make a little bit of money off of it when enough people do it. So that's just full disclosure there. But like I say, it doesn't affect the cost to you at all. But until next time, that was The Wisdom of the Hidden Realms by Colette Baron Reed. And this was Pink Moon Tarot. Have a great day. Namaste.